So here are the four talking points that I use that helped me sell over 50 homes and make over $300,000 my last year of selling real estate. Number one is introduction. Who are you and why are you calling? Hi, my name is Spencer with ABC Realty. I noticed you just put your home on the market. I'm sure you're getting dozens of calls, but I was just generally curious if you had any questions or concerns about the sales process that I might be able to assist with you today or help out with today. Number two is I'd build some rapport. So if you get this home sold, are you, what are your plans next? Are you looking to relocate somewhere or are you wanting something different in the area? This opens up to building rapport that actually pertains to the home, the sale of their home. That is where a big mistake a lot of people are making is they're talking about the weather, which has nothing to do with their home, rather than talking about building rapport that actually has to do with selling their home. Third talking point is time frame. how you can get a time frame. So, so is there a certain time frame in mind where if your home hasn't sold, you might be open to other options or is there a certain time frame where you have to relocate? Or, yeah, we need to have it sold within the next 30 days. Okay, great. You can dig deeper. Are you looking to have it sold or closed in the next 30 days? Are you looking to have an offer in the next 30 days? Like, what does that mean? Get some more clarification. Oh no, we're just testing the market. We don't really care when it sells. We just want to get top dollar. Okay, perfect. Now you know how to handle that. You might have this one. Oh, you know, in the next, you know, three, three to four months, you know, ideally we'd like to have it sold. Okay, great. Now that will help you go into step number four. Four, we're going for the close. If you don't go for the close, there's really no point in even doing all the aforementioned things that I said, even picking up the phone and calling. Because if you're not gonna ask for the listing appointment, there's no reason to even call. Would you be open to having me swing by for 15 to 20 minutes tomorrow around 4.30? to come by, take a look at the house, review some market information, as well as some of our services. You know, if the glove fits, great. If not, at least you have some more information to use moving forward. Usually that would open them up to then having me swing by for 15 to 20 minutes whenever that, whenever we booked it. Now, one key point is to booking appointments, you never wanna book out set past 72 hours because they're gonna go ahead and they'll probably forget about it. And you don't wanna be showing up to a house that is no, where no one is there. So never book an appointment past 72 hours. I always try to go for the same day or the next day if possible, if they say they can't do that, then I always go for uh, the following day, but I never go past 72 hours. Hopefully this video helped you. Hopefully this video, if you're an agent, hopefully this video helps. This is exactly the formula I use to make sell over 50 homes and make over $300,000 in gross commission incomes in my last year selling real estate.